Chuck E. Cheese's. It's cool. For real. All right. Pizza review time. $5 pizza from Chuck E. Cheese. Let's see what we got here. My expectations are not very high. Ooh. It's, it's very hot on my legs. Very hot. Get a good look at it here. It kind of looks like a, a Papa John's pizza, to be honest with you. Alright, one bite. Everybody knows the rules. I'm running my lap. It's it's not too bad. I was expecting worse. Remember, back when we were kids and there was that reading challenge, if you read enough, you got a free uh, personal pan pizza from Pizza Hut. I had one of those one time. I don't think I actually read it. I just cheated on it. I got my free pizza. It was so bad. I would need it. My father would need it. The dogs would need it. It was bad. This is better than that. And what's up with all the, the mice and rats and rodents like in pizza? And I just realized that Chuck E. Cheese is a giant mouse. And he runs at arcade and cooks this delicious pizza. And then I was thinking about it, Ninja Turtles, Splinter. You know, he was a giant rat. And the Ninja Turtles all love to eat pizza. What do you think? You may talk about it. <clears throat> it tastes pretty good for five bucks. Not bad for five bucks. Like a regular, yeah, you know, at a pizzeria, what is it like? Uh, Thirteen bucks, fourteen bucks for a cheese pizza. I mean, looking at it, all they did was heat up a frozen pizza, cut it, and sell it to me. So five bucks, and a frozen one in the grocery store is, I don't know, three to five. So you're really making out here. What kind of score would you give it? Zero to ten. I don't know. It's all right. Six, I guess. A six. Wow. Rookie score, but we'll work on that. I'm going to have to agree with my father and give this like a five eight. It's pretty good. No flop, sturdy. The underside's not bad. Five eight, and that's a review.